that about a half of all cancer patients receive radiation therapy as part of their treatment plan? It is a common therapy, but it can cause changes to your skin. It is important to know how to protect your skin to avoid a condition called radiation dermatitis. This is a skin reaction which sometimes occurs when people receive radiation therapy. Irritated skin can make it difficult to enjoy life and participate in your everyday activities. Sometimes if skin breakdown is severe, the doctor may have you take a treatment break for a few days to allow your skin to heal. This means your treatment plan will take longer to complete. To help prevent radiation dermatitis, here are some important things for you to avoid while receiving your radiation treatments. Do not rub or scrub the skin with anything that may irritate the skin. Things that can irritate the skin over the treatment area include washcloths, loofahs, and mesh scrubbies. In addition, wear loose clothing to avoid rubbing and friction on the treated area. Do not scratch your skin. If itching starts, notify your nurse. Do not use hot or cold water when showering. Only use lukewarm water on the treated area. It is important to keep your hands clean and to shower and bathe, but do not use soap on the treated area. Do not sunbathe or use sunscreen on the skin in the treated area. Stay covered up or stay out of the sun as much as possible while receiving treatment. Do not use deodorants that contain metal. Your nurse will recommend some products that you can use. Do not use shaving products in the treatment area. If you must shave, only use an electric razor. Do not apply hot packs or cold packs on the treatment area. Do not use band-aids or tape on the treated area. Carmona's Radiation Oncology Nurses use a set of guidelines for you to follow to protect your skin. Your nurse will provide you with special wipes to cleanse your skin and aquaphor to apply after cleansing your skin. Be sure to use only the products provided by your nurse. Clean the skin twice a day using the cleansing wipes given by your nurse. Make sure to gently wipe the skin over the treated area with two wipes each time. Make sure you are cleaning the entire breast, including under the breast and under the arm. Then allow the skin to dry completely. If your breasts are large, you may find this easier to do lying down. Once the skin is dry, apply Aquaphor to the skin. Use a small amount. Do this twice a day after cleansing the skin with the wipes. Spread the Aquaphor over the entire breast, including under the breast and under the arm. Use the wipes and apply the Aquaphor after radiation therapy and then just before bed. On non-treatment days, follow the same routine in the morning and before bed. Follow these guidelines and you will decrease the risk of developing radiation dermatitis and other skin conditions associated with radiation therapy.